thanks for clicking in. It's Monica, welcome. So let's layer some blush. I'm gonna start with the Ben Nye Pressed Color Palette and I'll be using Pink Bliss. And that is the Real Techniques Blush Brush. And the whole idea with layering blushes, um, this is just something that I came up with myself. I don't know of anyone else doing this. Um, I'm sure someone does this, but I don't know if it's like an official uh, makeup technique. But basically the idea is to take first a matte light color brush, blush, excuse me, um, and put that down as the base and put it like all, I, for example, I put it all across the apples of my cheeks, my cheekbones, and kind of up to my temple. And as you can see, I like putting some at the very top of my forehead, top of my nose, and my chin. That kind of just brings the whole look together for me. And so that's like the base. The next blush I'm going to be using is the Milani Baked Blush, and that's in Dolce Pink. This one has shimmer to it, and so the idea here is to use it as a highlighter. So it's got a blush color to it, of course, but this is a good idea if you don't want to use a shimmery um, blush all over your cheeks. So you can use this to give you some color in your cheeks or just in a part of your of your cheeks, but also you're using it as a highlight so you just concentrate it on the tops of your cheeks. I am using a, I think it's an up and up brand from Target stippling brush and it doesn't have a name on it. see the highlight there it looks really pretty and the last blush is a really dark or bright colored blush and this one is by wet n wild and it's in heather silk and I'm concentrating this mostly on the apples of my cheeks and the whole idea is not to put this bright or dark color all across my cheeks because I think that's when you start kind of looking older and it just looks overdone in my opinion And the brush I'm using is a dual fiber brush and it's by Rite Aid Renewal brand. Here, I am using EcoTools um, Angled Blush Brush and cleaning it off with my color switch. And I'm just blending everything in. So I hope this video was helpful and just gave you some new ideas of how to use your different kinds of blush. So thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe and I will see you next time. Best wishes everyone.